Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, first of all, I would like to thank my Armenian host, Foreign Minister Ararat Mirzoyan, with this visit, closing my trip as the OECE Chairman in office to South Caucasus, I reassert OECE's commitment to peace and stability in the region. My serious concern that the security situation in the region remains very fragile was among my most important messages to the host. Our talks focused on the situation in the region and on exploring options for increased OECE's engagement in and with Armenia. Polish OECE chairmanship strongly supports all initiatives aiming at facilitating dialogue between Armenia and Azerbaijan. Genuine dialogue is crucial to enable trust and advance de-escalation. We are determined to appeal to both Armenia and Azerbaijan to engage in good faith in negotiations to reach comprehensive solution to all outstanding problems. We hope that the progress can be made particularly on the pressing humanitarian issues, such as release of remaining detainees, sharing information on missing per people, demining, as well as protection of historic and cultural sites. The OECE and Armenia have a long-standing cooperation, notably through OEC's support to Armenia's reforms and to the Armenian Cooperation Program. This unique format is welcomed by both parties and should continue. The OEC stands ready to step up its engagement in and with Armenia through new programs across the three dimensions of security. The evolving situation in the wider region calls for intensified reflections on bilateral and regional initiatives. I hereby would like to express my gratitude to the personal representative of the chairman in office Ambassador Andrzej Kaspczyk for his lasting efforts and involvement in bringing durable stability and reconciliation for the region. Thank you.